Okay, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, starting this video out very unconventionally, because I'm clearly not in my room with bookshelves. Um, but, so, this video, you could probably tell by the title, um, I'm going to Covington this weekend with some friends, well, one of my best friends, and then my cousin, uh, we're going to Covington to do all things Vampire Diaries, and we're even going to go to Conyers and do the originals and do all the, you know, all the vampire things. So, yeah, this is kind of just going to be a vlog of this trip. So right now I'm leaving work, going home. I'm going to chill at the house for a little bit because uh, Emily has a meeting, and so we can't leave right away. Uh, but I'm going to go home and chill for a little bit and make sure I've got everything packed and load up my car and go pick up Carly and then we're gonna travel to pick up Emily and go to Covington. Um, you've probably not met Emily before on this channel, I don't think, um, unless I've vlogged something that I don't remember vlogging. Uh, you've met Carly, if you've watched my other book shopping video, then you've met Carly. Um, you probably know Hallie at this point if you follow my channel. Uh, Carly is Hallie's sister, so yeah. I'm going home to pick up Carly, so I will update later. So I got Carly. We're going to get Emily, and then we're heading off. We're stopping by Bojangles to get lunch, and then we're going to go. Starting stuff. off real healthy. Oh, oh, oh. This is why we don't vlog and drive, ma'am. It's okay. We didn't die. We're alive, unlike the vampires in Vampire Diaries. <laughs> okay, we'll see you there. Made it to Covington and we're about to get Carly. <laughs> and we're about to eat at Chili's and our hotel like literally right across the street. So we just got here. There was so, there was much, traffic. so much traffic. I was severely stressed. Partially because I think we came across like four wrecks. Yes. And a car on fire. So, yeah, and there was a car on fire. So you know. <laughs> Good times. I know. Um, but we're staying about 10 minutes out from where the Mystic Grill is, which is where the town square is. Um, but tonight we're just going to eat and then go back to the hotel room. I brought phase 10, so we'll probably get into that and then hit the bed and then wake up. And, running tomorrow. And we're going to go tour. And I think we're just going to do here. I don't know if we're going to do Conyers or not. It's only 10 minutes away, so we probably could. Um, but we're going to try and call in the morning or stop by and get... Uh, our name put in to eat at the Mystic Grill at some point tomorrow, which I still don't know how we're supposed to do that. I'm about to call him tonight and see if I can yeah. figure that out. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so I will update later. Bye. <laughs> Emily, are you enjoying your Duncan? Love it. Good morning everyone. So we've been to Duncan to get coffees and muffins and bagels. Um, so after this, we're gonna go ahead and go into town and we're going to tour Covington. Super excited. Very excited. Um, so we're supposed to see the town square, obviously the Mystic Grill. We're gonna make, uh, put our name down for tonight. And then we're gonna go see Elena's house and Caroline's house and the cemetery. Uh, Lockwood Mansion and then the Salvatore house, which was also the plantation home that they used in Sweet Home, Alabama. So I'm very excited about that. So, wait. What's everyone most excited for? 
<laughs> got oh. Carly taking a selfie. What are you most excited to see? The Mexican Grill. I'm most excited to see the town square. Same. I just want to see the clock tower. Yeah. But also, if we're in the cemetery and a crow flies by, I'm going to assume that Damon is here. Damon. He's here. Okay, so we'll update later. feeling about the trip so far love it we're loving life i bought so much stuff so far i've spent so much money but it was all worth it don't put the bags in emily's car we're just chilling Okay, so we finished touring Covington today and we went to Conyers and yeah, we saw all the houses which you'll have seen in this video. So now we're just chilling. <laughs> Probably gonna play some Phase 10 and then we're gonna go back. And we have reservations at this place called City Pharmacy. Yeah, City Pharmacy. Um, so we're just gonna go back and sit and snack and chill. Be merry. Yes be great um i got a lot of stuff but i will show you that later so yes so this is obviously not the same day this is obviously after i got home from the trip but i realized i forgot to show you guys everything that i got so i thought i'd do that now and i got this shirt which says the vampire diaries 2009 2019 and then on the back it has the town sign Welcome to Mystic Falls, a tree, and I assume that's a white oak tree, and then a crow. And then on the front it also has the bell tower. I got this shirt down at the Alley gift shop, and it just says Covington, and it says Georgia, and then it's got the bell tower on it. Um, and then the Alley gift shop had a Harry Potter section, which obviously we know I wasn't going to pass up. And I got this Butterbeer Woodwick Candle. 
oh my gosh, if you could smell through my phone, like this smells exactly like the Butterbeer drinks you can get at Universal Studios, uh, Studio Tour, wherever you get it. it smells the exact same. It smells like butterscotch and caramel and it smells amazing. And then I wanted to get a Brothers Bond bourbon bottle while I was there. I figured they would have it somewhere um, for my shelf. I don't drink bourbon, but I was gonna stick it on my shelf. But actually the Alley Gift Shop sells decorated bottles for $30. So I got this instead and it lights up. So I thought that was pretty cool. So that's definitely going on my shelf. Thanks, Paul and Ann. The next thing I got was a vial of vervain. And yes, this is a real herb. You can put it in your tea or whatever, but they sell the vials of vervain. Um, so I got one. I've got some labels, um, some like actual labels. And I think I'm going to put one of them on there and write vervain on there. Really cute and cursive and calligraphy. So yes, we got a vial of vervain from my bookshelf, of course. And then one of the last things I got was Elena's Daylight Ring. Uh, at the Vampire Stalkers gift shop, they do sell daylight rings um, in ring sizes. You get to pick your size. And the guy that rung me up was nice enough to let me try it on. So I wear a size 8, so he let me try it on just to make sure it fit. And if it's perfect, you know, I'm ready to walk around in the sun now. It's great. Uh, they had everybody's, the uh, Alley gift shop has everybody's too. Um, a little smaller, which I kind of, kind of, tiny bit wish I would have gotten it down there. Because, like, obviously this is bigger size than it is when Elena wears it at the show. Her ring is a little bit smaller in the show. Um, but I do like this. I think it still looks fine on my hand. Like, it doesn't look too big. Uh, so it looks good. If I was going to get Caroline's ring, I would definitely buy it at the LA gift shop. Because otherwise, where they've sized it up in the Vampire Stalkers gift shop, it might look a little bulky, unless that's just the kind of ring you like. Um, so I think I would get Caroline's ring down at the other gift shop, just because it would be smaller. Okay, so Covington was a success. Emma's in the shower. It's currently, what time is it? 8.15. Okay. Yeah, it's 8.15. Um, we're going to go down and eat breakfast and then come back up and pack and then go home. This has been a lot of fun. Um, but yes, we're going home. We drove by Elena's house one last time last night so we could just gaze at the beauty. Um, but yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video. And I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.